My name is Josiah Ray. I'm going to show you how to insert a header with columns in Microsoft Word. So here I've got Word open. I'm going to come over to the Insert tab of the, uh, of the home of the uh, ribbon. And we're going to come underneath Header. And let's look for a header that's kind of got a couple breaks in it. Now this one does, but I know from experience that these aren't actually in columns. They're just kind of individual text boxes. This one, however, is in columns. So let's click on that. And you'll notice that when we put this in, we get a whole mess of extra tabs up here. We get the design tab, which you usually get, so you can change uh, numbers and stuff like that of the different headers. But we also get this layout and design tabs underneath table tools. So this, what it has created, is actually a mini table inside of your header. And that's perfect. That's exactly what we want. What I'm going to do is if you hover over the top of this, you can see that little down arrow that you get any time that you're over the top of a column inside of a table. And so I'm going to click down on top of this first column. I'm going to come over and say split cells. And I want two columns instead of just the one that's there. I say OK. And now I've got three individual columns inside of my header. They're all still formatted and styled exactly the way I want it. I can change it at any time. And you can add more columns, subtract columns, put anything that you want into them. So I hope you've enjoyed this video on how to create a header with columns in Microsoft Word. I'm Josiah Ray.